Hello guys, my name is Chatelier and welcome back for yet another episode of Mu and Texas uh, Saving the Paradise with Custom Nations in North or well, America and I am joined by Mus and Torg and uh, I guess we'll be fighting our neighbors once again As we do, Torg is already fighting his neighbors I think those neighbors are really really not liking it much, but hey. I mean, I, I think there's been like maybe worth a year of game time where he's not been at war. <laughs> if that. Yeah. No, no, no. no you the stay togs. The togs must flow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's... Oh, hang on. Yes, admin tech four is there as well. Awesome. Now I can build workshops. Oh, my population is over a hundred. Nice. I haven't checked in a while, let's see. 448. 448, so that's like 4 million and... Yeah? Well, um, pretty good. Yeah, I'm not, not unhappy with this. So, uh, Mame. Oh, I'm going to need a diplomat back. Actually, I'm going to bring them both back. Oh, that's not good. As I said, Mame. Conquest of Paradise. How about it? Nope, they actually did go in for it. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to leave Mame to it. I'm first gonna go after chuck them all. I'm gonna start building spy network in two countries at once. Aha! Stability improvement. I like it. Nice. Bastard thinks. I think that's a good idea. Sieging my colony. Oh, you actually managed as well. Okay. I'm losing 800 sailors. I am so worried right now. <laughs> oh no. Hey, Chuck Smell, guess what? I got a tech up on you. Maybe two. No. Okay, I can now have five deeper relations. Wow. That's another claim. And that's a couple of cores for me. Yay, back to level 3 education. Okay, that's a stack wipe. Yeah, probably after this war I should uh, just chill out for a while. Because my max manpower is right now 8,000. Hmm, yeah. Manpower in MNT is uh, brutal. Mine's 48,000. I'm still at 59k, <laughs> but I'm guessing after this war it's gonna be a bit lower. Yeah, probably. I mean, I have a big pool to draw from, but uh, it's still gonna hurt a bit. Okay, a few, a few more months and I'm getting my course on the first provinces. Nice. Just in time to get new ones. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Quick, quick, Mary. Oh my God, thirty-five percent.
god, your attrition here is horrible. 35%. Oh, that's pretty bad. Yeah. I'm gonna fight you. Don't wanna desync it. Oh shit, you got it. No, no, you don't. Now they got pretty good discipline, though. Yeah, they got quite a good discipline. Won't help them much, though, because my morale is slightly higher. Yeah, true. 1.8. Okay, that's done. Okay, so how does one actually improve their development? level because mine is level 2 and I saw that you had level 1 development what do you mean uh there's some modifier called development level I think oh right oh I don't have the money okay don't move don't move don't move thank you And uh, that's another siege, and that's another war. Where the hell are you? Oh, you're going there, probably. Run! Run, you fools! Okay, <laughs> fighting the army of my enemies as rebels, and we were both getting zeros. That sounds fun. Yeah, but I won. My god, the attrition on these areas, bloody hell. That's better. Oh, hang on. I'll take it. Well, no, I no. might have the least population, but I do have largest typeface. <laughs> you do indeed. I mean, it's probably largest in the world, as far as I know. Mm. I'm not 100% sure about that, but... Well, oh, prove yes. me wrong. Forgot about my war taxes. I always forget about the war taxes. Yeah, I know the feeling. So, I, how much population do you have, Moss? Four for eight, maybe a bit less now. Let's oh, see. okay. Four for nine. Because I have five for one. Nice. Wow. Yeah, eight hundred and you're a man. Yeah, eight hundred and, and you're a major power, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, something like that. Four hundred seventy-nine rule, thirty-four urban, and twenty-eight upper class. Nice. Wait a minute. I actually have more upper class than you do. Out of 30. Huh. Weird fucking Floridians. <laughs> Scandal. Oh no. There's some taking the corruption. Oh, you're leaving. 
Oh wait, so no, Mas, how, how's your war going? Uh, not quite as well as expected, but on the other hand, they're taking quite a bit of attrition in my capital, so ah. I'm gonna leave them to it there. Oh yeah. Just had to split. M oh, my education went down again. And That's I have to split my army a bit because otherwise uh, I'm taking too much attrition. Ah, uh, yeah. I took 35 attrition on my 14 stack, so and that was really hurting it. Also, the the growth of my army wasn't going well then. You know, I could probably bring my army over and offer them as uh, Kondochieri. That may not be necessary. Because I'm gonna get chucked and all out of this war now. Ah, uh, fair enough. No, nope, I guess I'll. Yet. I guess but I'll just invade my neighbors then. <laughs> hey, we'll just have go to. home and punch natives. <laughs> <laughs> Stop besieging that land. Tell me, ah, oh, there we go. I wonder, do I have any aggressive expansion? None whatsoever. Why well, eight? Well, kill him before that army comes in. Oh shit, okay. Roll better, you fool! I really do mean roll better. Christ. Oh wow. So, Tog, are you having peace with all your neighbors right now? For now, yes. I'm coring. No, actually, I think you do have one neighbor you're not at war with. Who, me? Yeah, you. Uh, there's uh, the blue one. Eh. And it is in your region. Still, I need the core stuff. Yeah, that's they true. Want to chill out. Oh shit! Why weren't you back on strength? Oopsie. You know, I may just take those Condottieri if you want to. Uh, I'm currently fighting my okay, own war here. Yeah. I oh. can, I can, uh, I can send you Condottieri. I may not need them though, but let's see how it goes. I got one war finished, it's just I need to mop up. Ah, uh, yeah. I made the mistake of going in a bit too early. Oh shit, my war exhaustion. And apparently I have corruption now. Oh wow, one of my provinces has wealth of 50 to get right now. I believe that's the only one. Yep. And I had to take a loan. Well, damn. Might as well spend the money. Now I had the loan. Thank you. Uh, more enemies. Okay.
Thank you. Your original plan failed, but... Yeah, they usually do. That's how this game goes, really. <laughs> Okay, two more years and I get more cores. Actually, one more year for that province, but... Okay. Wow, that's a lot of uh, very angry natives there. <laughs> that's oh, a, wow. That was an AK stack that just wiped uh, some yeah, troops of the army. That is quite a few. Mm -hmm. And that's another war. Hey, you. Yeah, they like running. Do they like having their enemy not take any casualties at first? <laughs> I was gonna say, I see 2k disappear, but... <coughs> They didn't even stand a chance. They didn't stand a snowball's chance in hell. Because that's a two-star general. I do plus 20% shock and fire damage. <laughs> yeah, that's point, quite a bit. Have 2.17 morale. Mm. <laughs> Just punch them in the face. Oh, oops. Uh, if you're going to stay there, I'm going to move my troops back. Okay. Apparently Actually, you should send that 2.9k staff to uh, start sieging down your province. Yeah, but I'm gonna need one here for the siege, because didn't quite have enough troops for the siege. Ah. Okay, I'm not taking ridiculous amounts of attrition this time. Can I core that? Well, well, I'm wow. getting colonists 160. now. 160, that's expensive coring. Jesus, again? This is another hill province, isn't it? Yeah, Highlands, thought so. I'll be back. Yep. Yeah, there's not... Well, I got my colonists, but I can't really board I mean, I guess if I take some upkeep away from my army, I could have um, two, maybe even three colonies going. It's only 0.50 per colonist, so it's not too damn expensive. Well, yeah, but my my income it is. Hey, hey, I can have light ships now. Once I've done, nice. done this, yes, and I will take them. Thank you. That reminds me, I should probably take that tech next instead of more ideas although yeah, next, next idea <laughs> sorry go on yeah i'm uh, from now on i'm gonna do all my ideas and then i'm going to go back to diplo but at least now oh. i can build trade ships so that's more income yeah. i mean my next idea would be settler increase plus five mm, yeah that's i think two down the road for me let's see what was it again uh, yeah, I need uh, first my scientific heritage, tech passed down by 10, and then I got colonial range and land force limit modifier, national unrest, discipline, and trade efficiency. Well, at least I'm getting my cores now on most of the lands I conquered. Yeah, I'm, uh, I just uh, gained one of my cores as well. Which is a good thing. August 71, four years to... Oh, that's easy. 
Oh, my population is 124 now. Getting larger. Indeed. That's good, good, good. Wait, is this now a city? No, it's still... Oh! <laughs> okay. Of course, they kicked out my colonists, so they stopped colonizing. Ah, yeah. They're all weeping for this song. Yes! Minus two war exhaustion. I can definitely use that. After this okay, war, I, did I will be uh, having to sit on my hands for a while. <laughs> yeah, I did get mazed, but it's next to the coast, not on the coast. Yeah. Should I have known? Aha, uh -huh, in another core province. Oh yeah, but you also got the lumber again. Nice. Yeah, I have four lumber. Actually, five lumber right now. Nice. But mostly fish. <laughs> but yeah, my max manpower is uh, 6.6k. Maximum manpower? Yeah, because of my overextension goes ta down 7,000. Oh god. Yeah, my max manpower is uh, 87.6. Minus 8.5 for overextension right now. War exhaustion isn't helping. Yeah, I mean, I don't really have a war exhaustion, but. This war has been going on longer than was initially planned, but hey. Yeah. That's good, you don't have any allies. That is good. Yes, I'm gonna just send the runners so I can call that province. There we go. So, how much population do you. Ooh, you have quite a bit of population in your colonies. Yeah, there's not the worst colonies. Um. I'm sick. I'm going home. Yeah, thanks for the help, mate. You're welcome. Thanks for the money. <laughs> <laughs> I'm oh, really that's why I was poor. Eat. Now I understand. <laughs> Let's see if you want to make peace. Diplomacy. Keeps. No. Peace offer value. Three. Okay. Wait, that's... But if you're my vassal, you get to live. Okay. You know what? Screw you. I'm going home. Fair enough. And I immediately got another CB, but hey. Uh, <laughs> not touching that for a while. I need to really, really let my war exhaustion go down. I was at 10. Ooh, that's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. Yeah, they uh, upped it to 30, by the way. Oh, It's not 20, okay. but 30, but still. Yeah. Send out those runners. And I have burgers all of a sudden. Okay. So what's uh, down the road for Togoland? Peace, I guess. <laughs> Personally, I think Togoland should probably sit on its hands for a bit. I'm not sure. Yeah, I should probably sit on my hands as well for a while. I mean, I've taken quite a bit of land in the past 10 years or so. Mm. Yeah, quite. And I d need to save up some money to pay off a loan and then start rebuilding my country. Or oh, you building have loans. My country. 
But hey, that will be for next time. Oh, that time again. Yes. Well, if you liked it or enjoyed the content, yeah, uh, please leave a comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. And do check the other perspective, uh, respectively, if you're watching on Master's perspective already, do check what I've been doing and vice versa. But other than that, thank you very much for watching, and until next time, bye bye. Uh -huh.